Hey and welcome to another video. This time I won't talk about what to do before the Aldebaran patch. Most of it you might already guess from my Aldebaran overview video, but I want to go more into detail this time. As I mentioned before we get an additional slot for level 75 plus cards on our gear. The gear needs to be level 80 plus, or at the same tier level. So level 70 white needs tier 1, level 60 tier 2 and so on. Blue gear needs to be level 80 or higher. Only MVP, Mini, and Boss Head Gears have Elite Slots. I don't think that they follow a certain rule. Some Head Gears have them, some do not. Here you can see all Head Gears that have them. Gold gear needs to be level 80. Level 60 gold needs tier 2. Vok and Murphy needs to be tier level 2. Odin's has elite slots from the get-go.
Of course we need elite cards for the elite slots. Blue cards level 75 plus are elite cards. Elite cards have have this text below, I'm an elite card you noob, yada yada. Or something like that. Unlocking the Elite slot, works the same way, as for normal headgear slots. Next we have the anti-downgrade stone. Here you can see what materials we need. I would save them as long as they're cheap.
Essence Enchant Transfer will need smelting, and gardening level 10, you can't really get ready for it yet. Besides saving muscle, crystals, or saving real money. Another things I can think of, is, if you're already max level you can save your Odins, to get an EXP boost after switching to third job. Thanks for watching, if this video helped you out please leave a like, and subscribe for future videos, see y'all.